Yo, welcome back to another video. This time I decided to remake my original glitches video, doing an updated version and showing you new glitches on all the maps. So let's begin. First up, we got Berg. And one of the simplest ones to do is go over to these boxes and blue container, hop on the box, hop on the other box, then walk on top of the container, shoot the wall and you'll be inside. You can do trick shots, you know, it's really helpful and really good for escaping situations as well. Onto the next one, we go over to this place right here, the water, walk on the wall, walk onto the barrel, shoot near the top of the wall and you'll fall into the barrel. You can shoot people as they come past as well. And next we got one by the truck where you go onto the wall, slide onto the barrel, and then shoot the truck and you'll be able to fall inside the barrel. And you can shoot people from spawn as well. Really, really helpful. This one's a bit more trickier. Go over to connector and into the corner between the wall and the door which is open shock and jump then spam crouch you should be able to go on top of the door with some practice and you know it's also good for trick shots and yeah helpful again you can just hide there and wait for somebody to come down below this one is another difficult one where you can go from under bridge on top of the bridge all you got to do is same technique shock and jump and spam crouch and eventually you'll be able to go through the bridge Moving on to Little Town now, it's really simple, just go on top of the balcony on Red House, walk over the ledge, I, I'm using a knife because it's faster, and then go to the wall, look at the wall, and just walk right down, and you'll be teleported through to the ground floor. Bringing it up a level, with the shotgun, make sure you're standing right on the door frame, look right up, and shoot that, and you should be able to go inside the wall down below. Again, you can shoot people from spawn, or as they come past, and the same could be done on the blue house as well. Uh, just walking make sure you don't jump and you'll be able to teleport down below and then again with a door frame except this time you won't be able to go all the way down you'll just be able to go halfway down but it's still really helpful to see where people are and then finally you can just walk over the ledge and shoot the wall and be able to go right down another one you go on top of the gas canister and then slide onto the barrel shoot near the top of the truck and you'll fall inside the barrel and then finally in the blue house if you go on top of this box and shock and jump again, spamming crouch, you should be able to go onto the second floor. And moving over to the red house, you'll be able to go on top of the TV to the second floor, just by shooting and pressing shift. Okay, next we have Sandstorm, and there aren't really many glitches on Sandstorm, a lot of them have been patched, and overall it's a really really solid map. These are more features I'd say. The first one is just simply sliding over this ledge right here, and you're able to go into market really easily and quickly as well. This one is more of a bug, I'd say. If you go over to the far side of market and you can spam shift all the way across that wall and it will just kind of teleport you. And I showed this in my last video, just simply shooting from backyard on top of this uh, decoration area. Make sure you don't fall through. You have to land on a wooden bit. And then next, this one is really difficult, I'd say. It took me quite a few tries to get it right. But you can go through the balcony and land on top of the ledge. And yeah, it's good for trick shots. This one is more of a feature because of the alien event that is going on in Krunker right now. If you go over to the big ad build board, you should just be able to strafe jump and get through it. Okay, moving on to Sub-Zero now. So the first one, just walk on top of the barrel right here, on top of the wall, then shoot the wall while holding W and A. It should just push you over to the side and you'll be able to get through the wall. Hop around the back side, look down and shoot, and you should be able to propel yourself on top of the house. You can hop about all these houses, by the way. There's not really any barriers or anything. And it's good for trick shots as well. It, you know, it'll look really, really cool in a video. Next is another simple one. And all you're gonna do is just walk over this ledge. Remember not to jump. Shoot the wall above you and you'll fall in. You can jump and shoot people as they come past. Or you can do this, which allows you to go through the backside. And yeah, they will never expect that. Okay, same thing again, except this time we'll be doing it on the left side. The shock and jump with spamming crouch. And you should be able to get to the secret area and you can propel yourself really high. So it's really helpful for trick shots. Next is by fountain and just walk on top of the fountain, go backwards onto the barrel and then shoot near the top of the cross and you'll fall into the barrel. Again, you can shoot people as they come past. This one is very, very similar. You're gonna be walking on top of the first barrel, then onto the wall, then onto the other barrels, go around and then shoot near the top of the wall and you'll fall into the barrel below you. This one is probably the most simple one. Walk up the stairs by the red carpet and shoot the wall and you'll fall inside. 
This one takes a lot of effort. All you gotta do is go by the wooden wall, go inside of it, and then spam shotgun jump with crouch, and you should be able to get on top of the wooden bit. Next, we have this one, really, really simple again. Just jump onto the wooden bit on the house, then shotgun jump onto the roof, and you'll be able to just wait here for people to spawn or come past and kill them really easily. This one is more of a feature, but I'd say it's very unpredictable. You're just gonna shotgun jump onto the box, and then onto this little wooden banister. Make sure you're holding against the wall at all times, otherwise you will fall off. Next, we've got undergrowth. Just hop onto this barrel, then walk onto this rock, I think it is, then shoot the wall above you and you'll fall right in. And you can shoot people as they come past. This one, similar to Sub-Zero, you're just gonna walk up the stairs and then shoot the wall and you'll fall straight through. Next is also similar to Sub-Zero, and you'll just be spamming crouch and jump to get through the wooden opening. This one is really effective for trick shotters. You're just going to hop onto this balcony and then on top of the wall, walk over the rock part and then shoot the wall just above you. You can just propel yourself really high. There are two ways to do this. The second way is just to walk onto this rock instead, shoot the wall behind you and you'll fall in and be able to do the same thing. Inside of hole, you can walk onto the wall and then onto one of the barrels, shoot the wall above you and you'll be able to fall into the barrel. It works on both of them so you can choose which one you prefer. Just make sure you're right above the barrel when you do it. Now we have Lost World. So the first one is to hop onto this barrel right here. Again, shock and jump and spam crouch, and you'll be able to face through the wall. You got this whole area to yourself, and you can just shock and jump on top of this wall and walk around and kill people. The next one is to walk up these stairs, walk onto the barrel, walk onto the main platform again, and then shoot the barrel in front of you and you should drop right down. Pretty useful for escaping situations. And this one is similar. We're gonna be walking up these stairs and then on the fourth stair from the top, you wanna slide onto the barrel. You can either shoot the cement in front of you or you can shoot the wall. I just say the wall is a bit easier to do. And yeah, you're inside the box now. Nobody can see you. The next one is the structure area. You're gonna hop onto the wooden barrel then crouch it over onto the cement, press jump, and then you'll be inside the barrel. Again, really, really helpful. This one is another barrel glitch, and this time you'll be hopping onto the wall, sliding over to onto the barrel, shooting at the top of the wall, and you'll be able to fall inside. And finally, you're just going to walk from the bridge into this small room and shoot the ceiling above you, and you should fall halfway down into the floor. Citadel has some really cool glitches, actually. The main one is getting on top of this tower. So the first thing you're going to want to do is walk onto the ledge and then onto the floor. Make sure to not jump and just follow me around here. Then shoot the wall and you should go underground. Then line yourself up, shock and jump through, and then once more. This time, same thing again, shock and jump with spamming crouch. It may take you a few tries to get it right. Once you're onto this bit, shock and jump it just once more and it should teleport you through. Finally, shoot the ground. You'll go absolutely flying and land on top of the tower. It is really high up. You can do some crazy trick shots off this thing. This one, you can get inside the side of the stairs. All you gotta do is walk on top of this area right here, shoot the wall just on the edge, and then you should be kind of pushed into the ground a bit. If you go over here, nobody will be able to see you. If you move just over a bit, you should be able to go inside the wall and shoot people as they come past. So it's really helpful. And finally, this one is a similar bug, and all you're gonna do is walk up the stairs, go over onto the side of it, and then shoot the wall near the top, and you should be pushed into the stairs. Next we have Freight, and Freight has some crazy glitches. Go over to the snow bit right here, walk over the ledge, shoot the ceiling above you and you'll fall right back down. Next you can go from under the bridge to where you were before by just simply spamming crouch and jump. You can use it with a shotgun but I just prefer to do it with your hands, it's much easier. And you'll be inside the attic of the house. This one is really cool. So again walk over the ledge, except this time look down and spam with your shotgun crouching again and you should be propelled through. You can go on top of the chimney and yeah, you can hit some crazy trick shots. Next is another clip and all you're going to do is just walk over these two stairs right here, shoot the ceiling above you and you'll be into the ground halfway. And I would call this one more of a feature because of the Easter event, but I think they forgot to remove it. Just go to the back side of freight right here and this wall, you can just walk straight through it. And then this one is more of a spawn trap and you can just hop on top of this light right here and shoot people as they come through. This one, you'll be able to go right on top of the power line. First of all, hop on top of the light, move back just a tiny bit, shoot and hold W, and you should be able to land on top of the wooden bit. Again, it's really cool for trick shotting. Finally, just go over the ledge and shoot the wall, and you'll be inside this box room, 
and yeah, there's no way to escape. Finally, we have Oasis, and this is honestly one of the most broken glitches I've seen. Just walk up these stairs, right here. And then on the second one from the top, go over just a little bit, and you should be able to drop right through. And yeah, it's secret area. I really don't know why this glitch exists, but it's kind of broken. And just in case you didn't see how I did it properly, I'll slow it down a bit. So again, go onto the second from the top stair, and then right on top of the wall, you kind of want to go down with it. As you can see, I'm halfway between the wall and the stairs. And yeah, you can get underneath the map doing that. It's pretty cool. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. I hope it was useful. Please don't abuse these bugs. Feel free to leave a like, subscribe, and yeah, I'll see you next time. Peace.